Welcome everyone. You're at Adrian's channel. Thank you for stopping by. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Thank you for being my friends. That's what the channel is about. You've really helped me. Uh, going in January will make one year and I've certainly grown and really gotten to know some very interesting women, some guys to boot. Yeah. So we have another fabulous Timo haul for you this evening. I think we should just get right into it. Okie dokie. All right. Well, I have my order next to me here, just in case we want other information. And a while back, I had hauled this laundry bag it's incredibly it's it's double walled it's absolutely double walled in this wonderful waffle mesh it keeps its shape the inside all of the seams are finished off really incredibly this easily will hold a pair of athletic shoes without a problem. Maybe a couple of baseball hats, maybe a, <laughs> a handful of bras, I don't know. Terrific padding, everything about it, such a good deal. And averages only $1.27 on the site. They come in large and they come in small. And that's what I got on this particular Timu haul, these phenomenal wash bags were on special for only 38 cents. And I was able to get two. So 38 cents. And right now, you might be paying up to $1.75. When I had checked, there was no difference between the small and the large size. Really, so it's like, oh, okay. Let's take a look, see. Oh, wow. Absolutely. I mean, look at how tall these are. You can fit a lot, a lot into this. I'm going to fold the original and, what you can see, yeah, that much more. And that means when something is that much more, it's that much more all the way around in the dynamics of the um, pattern that they made. Oh, and I tell you, these to take traveling just adds another maybe little bit of cushion in your suitcase. That can be very, very helpful. <laughs> And washing things out, and you can just hang them up. It's got even a little hang it tag right there. So these are a terrific value. I love things that can help separate, coddle, <laughs> and help me have laundry day be easy peasy. Yes, yes, indeed. Oh, well. I have a whole bag of stuff here and more. <laughs> After I priced it, I kind of laid it around. So first, I just want to get out of the way with these fragrant sachets. Ocean. I had chose two of the ocean, one jasmine, and one lemon. It's pretty much paper. That's what I'm smelling. Paper. I've opened each of them up and held my nose up inside trying to really get a whiff. When I was buying for a store of Bath and Butler in Hawaii, I carried a lot of the higher quality sachets. These are a knockoff of. They are definitely, they, they have no scent 
And even though I was able to get them for only 39 cents and they are still that price online right now, I am going to be requesting a return because that's a dollar sixty. We all know, especially I know how I can stretch a dollar sixty. I'll be able to show you that today in some of these delicious bargains that I got. Yeah. But uh, no, I refuse to pay for nothing. Uh uh. No, no. So these are going to have to have their picture taken and put on the yes, I want a refund. Yowza. Yeah, I do. <laughs> All right, what's over here? Let's see. I have never bought the little hair. Instead of like, you know how we always get the um, stretchy little elastic hair ponytail makers and such. Well, forever, Timu has offered sort of like just a piece of fabric that piece of fabric that's just chopped off and each one of these can be a fabulous ponytail maker especially when I need to do my space buns and such right but they're so stretchy they're so nice they're nicer than the elastic I can now see why they were so extremely popular. Well, I got a whole pack of 50. I thought I would share these with my daughter-in-law who has exquisite, exquisite long hair. Oh, just the other day, I caught her on camera talking to her and it was suddenly I was like, <gasps> it's like her hair had grown six inches. It just exquisite hair, exquisite. So, again, I paid 38 cents, and you may be paying 72 cents. <laughs> These come on special all of the time. I'm just really, really stoked at how they feel. I am looking forward to those very, very much. Very much. Good deal. And as I said, now you, you're catching 38 cents. Wow, 38 cents. Got some very delicious, delicious, inexpensive items. Okay, let's giggle together on this. Now, I am not a proponent for buying what I call Mylar balloons. Especially when I was living in San Francisco. All of those, you know helium mylar balloons were a hazard to um, fish and wildlife. So I long ago created a prejudice against them. And this is not a type of foil that is recyclable. But what did I get? <laughs> oh my goodness, look at Santa. I just love his little chubbiness. All right. Come on, Santa. Come on. Here we go. One little foot down. We want to see you looking good. Looking good. Come on. You got to represent. Oh, no. What? what? What's going on? Okay, no. Oh, there they are. Okay, Santa. <laughs> I got this cute, like, four-foot Santa um, printed on both sides, of course, and just really jolly, jolly, jolly. And what I was thinking to do with him is blown up. That would be kind of 3D on my front door. And I'd mentioned that the front doors in my apartment complex are metal. So I'll be able just to hold this up with a uh, magnets and I showed the magnet hooks that I'd recently picked up too but this is going to be the beginning of something precious I love the jolly holly colors 
And he's got a really, you know, all the way, big hat, big face. And I, I like how he's just kind of shaped round, almost like he's an ornament. He's the perfect size. Wow. Well, initially I paid a dollar ninety nine, and this whole order that I'm showing you, many, many, many items, got um, price adjustments. Lots. This order had lots. So. Right now, when I looked it up, you could get it for a dollar and seven. That goes to show I have a lot of price adjustments. <laughs> well, I'm so excited for this to be on the front door. Right after Thanksgiving, I can start planning my door decoration. Because I didn't do anything for Thanksgiving. Okay. That was such a great price. Great color. And I know from my trip to England, when I had taken these type of mylar balloons. I had taken the huge three-tiered birthday cake and crowns and all kinds of stuff. Once you blow them up and they come with this like little straw thing that, that you can put in, they do not deflate. They do not deflate. So, uh, last a long time. So I'm imagining this is going to be quite the door decoration. Yay! Oh, let's find something else that was really, really affordable. Oh, okay. This is the second time. I kind of fell for it, as it were. What else? But 48 cents. I like to get the little mousy stickers. They are stickers. And you can put them on your baseboard. Or like I have a little archway in <laughs> the archway. I can see them from the lounge. And this one, since I'm in my jolly holly Christmas mood, this one shows you a really precious little mouse in front of a fireplace, which actually has stockings were hung with care. And little mousy is right there. Well, the reason this is so grainy and this, that, and the other, this is homemade, baby. <laughs> Somebody is ripping off this artwork and just putting it on regular paper that we could purchase, you know, like a contact paper. I, whatever. It's 48 cents. It's a mouse. It's Christmas. I will be decorating with him. And right now you could still get it for 48 cents. Lead it not be me to trample on some poor little entrepreneur in China <laughs> trying to get a few more shekels. Yeah. Okay, so that's kind of cute. I do like my mice. I do like my mice. Oh. This is a multi-cleaning pen. That's how they're advertising it. And, of course, they've put this sticker on the back, which covers up the directions. But they're to clean your earbuds. Not that I have anything of that nature, but my grand teen does. So I thought maybe he'd like to have this. Let's see. Okay, it just white cylinder, plastic, sturdy. Okay, let's see if I can separate it. Ooh, okay. Well, ooh, little spongy cleaner there. And this thing that's like gonna go Well, <laughs> makes me rethink it a bit. This is like something he should not have on him, you know? He would get in trouble at school if he had this on his person. Oh. But I got it for 39 cents, and you can get it possibly for 74 cents. Yeah, yeah. I hate to look at things like that and, and then have to flash upon how they could wreak havoc on a teenager's life, especially... And my grand teen is Portuguese, Hawaiian, Vietnamese, 
and Caucasian. So he's a brown boy, gorgeous, gorgeous brown boy, brown like his daddy and beige like his mama, his mama's Vietnamese. <sighs> Gotta worry about the teens. Gotta worry about the non-white ones in different ways than you worry about the white ones. And I can say that, I am obviously white. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Worrying about the children. Always worrying about the children. Okay, let's let's lighten up, lighten up and see something funny. This is a little badge, a pin, the kind of thing that you either would put on your vest, on your Levi jacket, on a backpack, tote bag kind of a thing. Everybody seems to you know, enjoy getting these little, you know, before we would have said brass, I have no idea what they're made of, but it's got the in the bag. Okay, can you see what it is? <laughs> it's a pigeon with a piece of bread around its neck. A pigeon with a piece of bread around its neck. Who thinks of these things? I don't know, Central Park, are they playing ring toss with pigeons, throwing full slices of bread? Who knows? But it was just silly enough that it caught my eye. Yes, I love food and art. Yeah, preciousness there. And I scored this little guy for only 19 cents you could possibly be picking him up for 67 cents. But gosh, I like him so very, very much. It's back of this is white. Okay, there we go. Da -da -da -bum -bum. Shadow puppets. <laughs> Score, 19 cents, very happy. I think he's funny. And I got another one of these type of pins. And this one, again, I scored it for only 19 cents. And you can get it in black, which I did, or white. 19 cents. You may be paying 57 cents. But this will speak to a lot of people. Here we go, put that down, grab it with the nails. Okay. Oh, goodness. goodness, Adrian. Okay, okay, here we go. We can do better. We can do much better. <laughs> can we do better? It's too peopley outside. It's too peopley outside. Yeah, it is too peopley outside. I love that a lot. I love that a lot. <laughs> you know, I got my ew people shirt, and now I've got it's too peopley. There is a strong sentiment. <laughs> of like-minded people out there with these same ideas. I love one gal that I watch, Hatter House, and one of their sign-off lines, her and her husband, Josh, is uh, watch out for the normal people. I adore that. Hatter House, how you doing out there? And we are always watching out for the normal people. Goodness gracious, yes. <gasps> fun too fun all right here's another piece of jewelry that i scored for seven cents i know i know and it's a pair of earrings and the tag is right across the front so you can't see what they are opening it let's see 
Okay, well, they've had the um, crap bent out of them, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> On this cheapy, cheapy, cheapy cardstock. And everything I'm doing has created shadows. Sorry, just don't have the lights in the best positions. Who knows? We're amateurs at hot. <laughs> but the back, these... Let's take one off of the little cardboard. Let's see if we can do that. And it's little silicone back. I'm gonna put down right now because I do have quite the fun time with the length of nails doing earring backs and stuff. So what we see for this one is it's giving you the illusion that it's two earrings, a solid gold one and a rhinestone one. And the way it's designed, this back piece here, see it? Looks kind of like a horseshoe. Your ear can sit in there like that cups the bottom of your earlobe type of situation, wherever your hole is. <laughs> and it looks like you have two different earrings on the solid, and it just has that one post. Yeah, okay. Let's at least see if I can put it into a hole. All right. I have no idea. But do you think they look like it's something? <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that would appear to be. Okay. But I don't think I had my, my lobe really tucked into it. I think that would take um, a little finagling a bit more to make that happen. <laughs> well, right now it's balanced in there and it's just precious, just precious and certainly worth every penny because there were only, what, seven of them? Seven pennies went towards this? And now you'd have to have 77 pennies, potentially. But you know, these things can always be on sale at another vendor. Always be scrolling. Always be looking. But I, enough, Adrian. Enough. Enough. What else is in the bag, Bruce? Let's see. What else is in the bag? Oh. Okay, you've been seeing me have several little trinkets that I've gotten for my daughter-in-law, who is um, a fabulous cook, and she got her KitchenAid mixer this year. So lots of great baking is happening as well. So I got both of us These are cake cutter releaser things. <laughs> cake demolding. Let's unmold the cake. We need to unmold the cake. So this lovely shape gets to go all the way around and it has curved areas. I'll open mine to show you, yes, and one for Winnie and one for me, and like I said, 44 cents in there, just that's the same price right now, okay, keep falling, keep falling, I'm falling for you, oh. you know, it's like you can see where you want to be, yet it's the likes of me. 
Okay, red chair. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. That's cool. You know, it's flexible enough, right? It's just gonna, so you can get in there and even with like, you know, words getting in a little corner so that nothing will stick. No, we want our cakes to plunk out in one cakely piece. Yes, so one for Winnie, one for me. And what fell? I have to go lean down. I'm back. Did you miss me? It wasn't that long a time. Okay. This also is for Winnie, and I scored it for only 27 cents. Stainless steel, and you might be paying a dollar seventeen for it. Yes, you might. You very well might. So let's get that bit of Oh, I like when it doesn't cut. Like, you're just there like, yeah, really? <laughs> Got it that time. So what this is, it's a powdered sugar. So it has the screen on the bottom. And it's just shallow, about an inch deep. Put your powdered sugar in there, and then you just... And I think it's nice to have a smaller size because you might think you're gonna get away with your big one and all, but you have more control. Yes, you never know. After all, you may be on the Great British Bake Off. <laughs> My favorite Netflix Sunday, watching Great British Bake Off. My favorite, absolutely. So, okay. Ooh, Winnie, we've got just all kinds of little kitcheny things, and that's what'll make her happy. If it's for the kitchen, she'll be amused with it, you know, and might even get some use out of it. Oh, right. Okay. This is a urinal. Yes, indeed, ladies. Certainly something that would be helpful in the car. So, it's for the ladies. You can kind of see the shape we're working with here, right? And let's see if there's diagrams. Well, there is. Yes, there is. This is a P. Peas, peas, travel urinal. Okay. Peas, travel urinal. So it's made out of silicone. It's hygienic, easy to use, allows women of all ages to urinate in a standing up position. You could be sitting down, or you could even be lying down. I'm trying to picture all of that. It's discreet, portable, and reusable, designed not to flow back. Okay, because it's just funneling through, because that's what it looks kind of like, a funnel, huh? So urine in the top, funnels down out here. But what they are showing is that Yes, do we get the idea? that we are taking our urinal and being able to hold it up between our legs and have the stream be angled away from our shoes. <laughs> I always carry different urinal type things in my car when I was driving from San Diego to Vegas to visit my grandson. And I have incontinence, and if you have incontinence, you gotta be able to pull over when you need to pull over. Thank goodness for strong tinting <laughs> on the glass, uh, the, the glass windows of my car. 
one does what one needs to do. For sure, for sure. So, handy dandy. I would take that traveling, absolutely. Okay, here's another thing that I got two of for only 37 cents and now possibly a dollar eight to you. And these are headbands for you just to put on when you're washing your face. That's some strong Velcro. So that's all you do is put it on, bring it around and Velcro it at the, you know, at the crown. And it's nice and thick. It's something between a, 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 a brushed, sort of a brushed towel feeling. But, you know, we have our little pink wrist goodies to catch the water and we can have this to catch the hair back, or some people probably even like to use things like this to do their makeup. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. All right. The French Lieutenant's woman. Yeah. The French Lieutenant's woman. So, two of these. Good price. One can be in the wash. <laughs> or one can be a gift. Okay, here's another super duper duper super duper deal. Nine cents. And you can get them for 39 cents, which is still incredible. And different, different storefronts carry them. They could be in different sizes, this, that, and the other. But they are glow-in-the-dark stars. So you get to decorate your room. Isn't that exciting? <laughs> Let's go ahead, open one up. Let's check it out. Because I really wasn't that sure of what's going on. Ooh, let's see. Okay, that appears just to be some interest. Oh, <laughs> do you see how this breaks up? into tiny little squares well it does so each one of those teeny tiny squares is supposed to represent a uh, double stick and you put one on one side and then that me thinks we wonder their stick to itiveness but they're fun they're pretty could even just have them in a dish, but I have to see if they do glow in the dark kind of a thing. Uh, that's what they're supposed to do. I have to get back to you on that, won't I? I just think this is too funny. Oh, the teeny tiniest, but for nine cents. This could even be, I don't know. See, I think of things to give like teens for the Toys or Tots teen gift. And I would think like, oh, and once again, I don't like where my mind goes. So it's like, oh, you know, that might be considered destructive. You know, they might decorate. Our... <sighs> but I will check it out and let you know if they did glow in the dark. Because we would love that. Okay, we got everything. Nope, there was one other thing in the bag, Goose. And what this is, is a protection whistle, okay? And uh, it says silvery, I don't know. I think that's all that it came in. I paid 48 cents. You could probably get it for 47 cents. But it's supposed to be a really, really sharp piercing. I'm going to just try one little blast. Well, I guess if I really laid into it, because it's got two holes, 
and then the whistly things there, right? Oh, you can see, okay, this could carry. This, this has noise I can carry. This is for your protection, gals. Uh, you know, if you're coming, it's dark at five o'clock. So if you're even just coming out of the grocery store then, now you have to worry because the parking lot is dark. So just have this ready. I'd walk out of the store being like, okay. <laughs> but safety first. And this could be a very inexpensive way to feel more secure because you know in a crowd anywhere you can call for help. Yeah. Yep. Yep, you can. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. This is the third one of these that I've purchased and this one only cost 21 cents. You could probably get it for 72 cents. That's about what I paid 50 something and 70 something for the other two that I got. And they're even called for your automobile, like your vents, that this is just a zillion soft, soft, soft bristles. Soft and bristle, bristle. How can a bristle be soft? <laughs> okay, so the hairs of the brush. So this is just supposed to be so good to do really quick, let's, you know, clean up in front of us in the car. We can just do some really quick goodies like that. Every guy loves new car special goodies and this and that. So this could make a really cute stocking stuffer gift. Yeah. And if you wanted, ladies, Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's very, very soft. Mm -hmm. Love it. Love it. All right. I paid 30 cents for this precious ring. Oh, what I didn't bring over. Remember, I had showed you uh, a phone case that I'd gotten um, a pop socket on the back that was a black cat that it was a mirror. Well, that phone case did not fit my I-13. So, screw that. <laughs> but this is the same cat that is the pop socket part of my cat. Now, what I adore, because like that cat, one blue eye, one yellow eye. There's its little, you might think that's my nail, but no, that's its little ears, the kitty ears. So this teeny, tiny, teeny, tiny, it says it's a funny black cat. Well, let's see. If, oh yeah, okay. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, soft kitty, warm kitty fur, soft and sweet, happy kitty fur. Oh, okay. Well, I like, I like it. It's a little bit big and it's plastic, so it's, it's open but not adjustable, but it's absolutely precious. I just love him. Oh, yeah, I like him a lot. Oh, and I paid, like I said, 30 cents, and it might be $1.21 to you. Might be, it might be. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> you might think this is a miniature, but they're representing it as a full size. Phone stand. Yes, indeed. <laughs> well, let's see. Let's get it out of its plastic container. Hmm? 
else do I have? The scissors. We have the scissors handy. Simply because we really have to see <laughs> how tiny this is. So it's going to sit on a flat surface. There's the back. See the sides. It's on a slight angle. You can see that. This part is on a slight angle with a lip so it doesn't slide off. So just sit it on your desk, things like that. This could come in handy, absolutely. But it's not real stable. You know what I'm saying? When you got your expensive phone in there, so don't put it on the edge of a desk type of situation where it could get knocked and, and your phone could go flying. But just for sitting, when you want it just to sit down for a minute near you on, you know, coffee table at home, the desk at work, the counter in the bathroom. Mm, that's the perfect place, isn't it? <laughs> and it happens to be Adrian's top color. Yellow, yellow, yes. Anything I can get in a yellow, I look forward to. All right, the very last item on this tremendous haul. Nails. Well, the, the black nails that I have on, I think it was maybe 19 cents for them. Well, I went all out. These were 57 cents. Mm-hmm and you might get them for 67 cents. But I'm gonna say right off the get-go, these are pretty small, okay? I'm just saying that this, I don't see one on there that looks like it could fit my thumb. It's not about the length of that. It's about the width. It's about the width. Well, they, okay, there's a, there's a biggie. There's a biggie down in there. And these are these, you know, interesting gradient black and red. Very, very, very powerful looking, aren't they? <laughs> so they'll fit fine. And I'm telling you, when I do wear these, they are going to be just so normal feeling for this length. I'll be able to do all kinds of cleaning and not have to worry that I'm going to pop one. <laughs> well, did we all enjoy today's rather large bag from Timo? That was a lot of stuff. Yeah, it was. Uh-huh, I think so. Let's, I'm kind of scrolling for the minute here. Okay. Oh, it doesn't give you that kind of info, or does it? No, it doesn't. I need to go back over. No, it doesn't want to do what I want it to do. So we'll just say, forget it. <laughs> All right, everyone. So please do remember, hit the subscribe button. Do give me a thumbs up for a like. That's what helps keep putting me out there to YouTube so that they can put me out there to get in front of more people that haven't seen me yet. It's all where they want to place you on the feeds. So you can help me with that and I do appreciate it. I appreciate all of you contributing to my having friends. And it's kind of, you know, it's holidays. Holidays are hard. I feel like I set up expectations that don't need to be there. Really, don't <laughs> need to be there at all. Okay, well, I had a lot of fun with all of this. I hope you did too. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>